hello. So, you gonna come pick me up? Alright, great. Alright, see you then. Hi, you're Mitchell. You ordered the cab? Overseas? Yeah. Is it getting any better over there? They say it is. You can't believe everything you hear in the news. I wouldn't. Hey! At least you made it back home safe. You turn into men and you think you can do everything yourselves. Yeah. By then we should be taking care of you. <laughs> well, come sit down. How long are you staying? A week. I've got some paperwork I have to fill out before I am uh, officially out and on my own. Do you have a place to stay? Yeah, yeah I've got a hotel room. You know you can stay here. I, I know. I know, but I wouldn't want to put you out in any way. Nonsense. It would be a pleasure to have you here. No disrespect, Mrs. Santiago, but you're not the only one living here. Camilla, the girls are going to kill me one of these days. I swear they have more toys here than a Toys R Us. Mr. Santiago, it's nice to see you again. It's not that he doesn't like you. It's just that with everything that's happened in the past year, losing said, it's been hard on everyone. It's fine. It's not like I'm not used to it. You've met my parents, remember? Either way, you're welcome to have dinner here every night. And if you decide later that you want to stay, <laughs> you can. Thank you. I know you and I spoke about such things on the phone, but with Florida being the way that it is and us not telling everyone, these are a few things I wanted you to have that they wouldn't have considered important. he had you in his life. This was the last time that we saw him alive. And he said it was one of the best times he'd ever had at home. I wish I could have been there. Yeah. I wish you could be here now. I can't take this. It was a symbol of your love for one another. 